we'll do MMA made easy, where we break hard techniques into easy chunks. Uh, today we're going to be looking at the transition from side control knees down to uh, gibble side control. So I have my partner in uh, knees down side control, and what I'm going to do is I want to transition to gibble. So I'm going to fake like I'm going for some kind of shoulder, uh, shoulder lock. So I'm going to grab onto his wrist. If you notice, most people, if you grab onto their wrist and push, what they're going to do is push right back. Okay, so that's what we're going to count on. We're going to push a little bit. When we feel that, we're going to let it go and push their elbow. Okay, so I'm here. I pull and push. From there, my left hand is then going to grab onto uh, their uh, tricep. Okay, so in one motion, it looks like this. I pull and I get trapped like here. At the same time as doing that, what I'm going to do is after I've grabbed this, I'm going to drop my shoulder into his face and I'm going to post on my right foot and push towards him. Then I'm going to drop my left knee so it comes up and behind his head. Sometimes you'll have a hard time turning them. You can also do the elbow pressure point on the hip flexor to facilitate that. From here, you're in gimbal side control. I think you can figure it out from there. Uh, let's go from a different angle. So I have my partner in the side control. I grab onto their wrist, allow it to fall back, catch with my arm, bring my left knee up as I take a uh, base on my right foot to push my leg towards my left shoulder. From here, I'm set up for a lot of that stuff. Okay. One more time. So I'm here, I grab, it goes up, I catch, and I go underneath. If you'd like to see that from a different angle or anything like that, please let us know and we'll make another video.